Hello everybody, I'm Raffaele Ronchei, Technical Sales of Midland Europe Company and today I'm here to give you some tips about Midland Bitimini. The four tips of today are First one, phone pairing Second one, intercom pairing Third one, voice dial command And last one, universal intercom pairing Let's start from the first tip, phone pairing. With your Midland BT Mini off, so no light are flashing, just press the control button up to 5 seconds up to get red and blue light flashing quickly. At this time your BT Mini is looking to pair to a phone. Enter to the Bluetooth setting of your phone and check Midland BT Mini. Click on the Midland BT Mini name and the BT Mini is paired to the phone. Now we talk about second point, intercomparing BT Mini to BT Mini. Pay attention that uh, both your BT Mini are switched on, so you can see the blue light flashing. Now press the control button up to 5 seconds to get uh, red and blue light flashing quickly. This is the intercomparing. Do it also in the second unit. And just wait a little bit. Now the two units are paired and if you click the same button that you use to make the pairing, you will open the communication between the two devices. The two purple light means audio active. If you click again, you will close the audio. You can do the same from the second unit. One click, it will open the audio, purple light active connection, and one click to close the audio. The third tip is a very important one, is how to activate the voice dial command. For the owners of iPhone's phone, it will be how to activate Siri. And for the owners of Android phone, we strongly suggest to use as a default application, Google Assistant. Okay, the phone must be previously paired and now connected to your BT Mini. Uh, with a simple double click command on the control button you will activate Siri if your phone is an iPhone with Android the command is always the same double click on control button and in this case you will activate Google Assistant the last tips the fourth one is how to pair your Midland Beat Mini with a different brand unit. To pair a different brand unit to your BT Mini, you have to pay attention that your BT Mini will be on and you can choose one of, one of these three buttons to press to pair the other unit. Okay, I'm going to choose volume down button and I will keep it pressed longer, up to five seconds, up to get red and blue light flashing quickly. From the other brand unit, instead to start the intercomparing procedure, I have to start the phone pairing procedure. Okay, in this moment, this one is trying to pair a phone, and this one is simulating to be a phone. You wait a couple of seconds and the two devices will be paired. When both units finish the pairing procedure, if you want to open the universal intercom audio, from the BT Mini you have to use the same button that you use to make the pairing. So with one click 
On this button, you will open the audio to the Sina device and with one click, you will close it. From the other brand device, as the other device seems to be paired to and connected to a phone, to open the audio, you have to use the voice dial command. So in this case, you have to press the voice dial like this. And when you want to close it, you have to press it again. Guys, keep the firmware of your BT Mini always upgraded to get the best performance of your device.